Good morning. Um, welcome to Tech Talks again. And today I have uh, Chioma Ifani Eze, the founder of Accounting Hub, and she works primarily with small businesses. And so, Chioma, welcome to Tech Talks, and thank you for coming on the show. Thank you for so, having um, me. So, tell me about C Accounting Hub. How did it start? Why did you start it? And how is it doing? Accounting Hub um, started in January 2016. It is essentially an accounting business. So we do accounting services. But with a twist, an interesting one, we plug in a lot of technology because we found that um, small businesses did not have access to the right accounting services. We needed to give them credible numbers to access a loan with any bank, to take decisions, and so we built Accounting Hub. Before now, a small business would need to ask a friend who knows a friend who knows a friend to find an accountant and we built an accounting shop. So why don't you go online and buy an accounting service like it was a product, put it in a basket, pay for it, and get it done for you. So that's what we did. And I, and I think that's, I mean, that's fantastic because, um, I mean, I just started a small business earlier and what I found was that, I mean, without awareness, the only, the only accounting services that one sees is um, things like QuickBooks where you actually have to pay in foreign currency. So my question is, so, in terms of awareness, how many people, how, we, how, we, how are you uh, trying to create that awareness for, for people? Because I know, I know, I think, you know, thousands of small businesses that, that, that don't even have an accountant, don't want to employ an accountant, mm -hmm. don't know how to manage their books, and it makes it difficult for banks to, to evaluate their, their business. Interestingly, times have changed. The business owners now know that there's a need. And we don't only do accounting, so we, de we do five core services. So there's bookkeeping, there's tax, so there's the tax man chasing you everywhere. Yes, there's processes, there are accounting systems, and there's stock taking. These are our five core services. And we find that the business owners now come reaching out to us. And then we, had, we found another interesting way to sell it. We started storytelling. So we tell the story of how Sikira in the shop has sold the dress and she didn't give Madame the money. It was only possible because Madame didn't have any inventory management. We tell a story of how the girl in the restaurant reduces the portions and makes more money and the customers go away. So the small businesses began to connect with the story. So we have huge followership on Instagram, on social media, because we tell accounting stories that resonate with them. So you started in January 2016, so you will be three years yes. in the next month. So how has it been? How, I mean, how has the story, uh, the journey been? Exciting. Over 300 businesses, accounting systems, 24 hours automation for over 250 businesses. In Sage, Nigeria, we have become the largest re resellers of the cloud accounting system. We have recently launched our own um, accounting tool that is called StockTrack to help inventory holding businesses. We have built a 2,000-man community of stock takers across Nigeria, teaching young people to count, to lift boxes, skilled or unskilled, to help small businesses even know what they have. We have paid these people 5,000 to 7,000 daily, paid over 1,000 of them. It's been an exciting story. So, um, question. So, is it internet-based or is it mobile-based? So, both of it. We use, we have all sorts of tools. Our own tool is web-based, but we have all sorts of tools we give businesses. For example, Sage is mobile and web. Our own tool is, is web-based. We use a process tool that is mobile and web. All sorts of technology tools. As long as it meets your need, we would give it to you. So, question for you. Uh, 300 businesses and we have 20 million small businesses in Nigeria. <laughs> How are you going to close that gap? I mean, I know you're, you're starting well now, but how are, you, how are you going to close that gap? How are you going to play a role in, 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 in ensuring that businesses have, I mean, like, if you don't look after your numbers, then your, your probability of survival is, is, is low, as we know. So we have to scale. The greatest challenge has been talent. I say to you that we hardly can find good accountants. So we're going to raise an academy, train the accountants to serve small businesses to be able to, so you need an accountant who walks into a small business and understands accounting systems, understands taxes, can deal with the tax man, can deal with the auditor. That skill isn't taught in the university. So we're going to have a finishing school where the accountant, the graduates come to us, we train them, and then we can 
serve more businesses. The model now is that one bookkeeper can serve up to eight businesses. So to serve a thousand businesses, please do the math. <laughs> so, so you have a, you use man and machine, technology and machine to serve people because they are small businesses and they are, they are capacity to understand technology and how to use it is, is quite limited so you use them to, to hand hold it so so that is where the gap is and that's how that's where it's getting interesting so um question and my last question um so if i go to instagram for example i see a, i think most of the in terms of gender businesses that use instagram to to, to sell are women so that does that also apply when, with people who are, are trying to access accounting services? Yes, a lot of those women reach out to us. A lot of the stock taking we do are fashion businesses. I sell shoes, I sell clothes. A lot of them suffer. The sales girl is stealing. I own a bakery. Yes, this morning I made a post on, on, on social media and I was looking at what social media shows us as our ideal customers. Interesting, a woman who lives in Lagos aged 22 to 45. That's what social media, that's, that's the indices it. we saw this morning, yeah. yes. So yes, we have a lot of them coming. Yeah. Fantastic. So thank you very much for coming on the show and then we'll um, continue the conversation offline. Thank you for thank having me here. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. Cheers.